Yo, what's up guys? Welcome back. Today I'm going to show you guys five at-home really simple core workouts. Alright, let's get into it. Alright, so your first exercise is going to be uh, laying down leg raises. Alright, so you want to do, you just want to lay down flat. I don't have like a yoga mat, so I use a uh, blanket. You want something soft on you because it's going to hurt. But, so what you want to do is, I like put my hands on my head, or you can make it easier and put them straight out, or under your butt, which is a lot easier. I like on my head because it makes it harder. You want to have your legs straight out with your toes in the air. You go up all the way to here and back down. And don't let your, your feet touch the floor. So you just go up. I like doing sets of 20. I do uh, set, uh, reps of 20, sets of 5. So up and down. So this, one, yeah, this one's a really simple one, but it hits everything and it helps you develop that V-line too that a lot of people like. So this is a great core exercise to hit all muscle groups. All right, for your second exercise, we're gonna do bicycles. This one's a little harder because it, you have constant tension on your abs the entire time, so it'll burn more. But this one works, your abs are insanely good. I love this exercise. So what you're gonna do, you put your hands in a lock them like this in the back of your head. You lift your legs up and you're just gonna act like you're going on a bicycle. So when this knee comes forward, you want opposite elbows and knees to come together. And you want your um, legs straight out to never hit the ground. So you're gonna keep alternating and keep your um, core up a little bit. So you have constant tension on your abs, and it's going to constantly work. And the faster you go, the more it'll burn. So that's your second exercise. I love that exercise. It's such a great exercise. I use it in a lot of my workouts. All right, guys, for your third exercise, it's going to be called in and outs. Essentially what in and outs are, so you want to be positioned like this. You want to have your chest up a little bit so you have tension on your core. So you want to have your legs about shoulder width apart, a little bit wider. In and outs, you're going to go lean to one side and reach over and under, uh, around your ankle. And you do the opposite side. You need to keep going. I like doing these where I hit 50 reps in total, both sides, and what this works is when you're sitting up like this, it's gonna hit your core here, but when you go to your side and you're crunching, you're gonna hear a whole oblique on this side, and on this side, it's gonna do the same thing for your oblique over here. All right, guys, your fourth exercise is gonna be a little more advanced, but this exercise is an insane ab killer. So what this one is called, it's called crucifixes. How you want to do it, I start by just laying down my legs up a little bit. So you're going to bring your ankles up, have them straight out, and you bring your chest up a little bit like how you did on your in and outs. Then you want to go up and put your hands underneath your legs, but don't touch your legs or grab them. And you go back out, almost like a crucifix pose. So that's why you have the crucifix name. This works your entire abdomen, it's great, I love this. Go back in and out. And that's what a crucifix is. But you end up in that position with a crucifix. All right, guys, for your fifth and final exercise, it's going to be mountain climbers. How you want to do this one is get down to a push-up position. You want to be about shoulder width apart, your back straight, and your legs out. Basically, all you're going to do is bring your knee to your chest and switch and alternate. You want to do it quickly, so something like this. And this is going to hit your abs and total, total abs. I like incorporating this to hit workouts. It's such a great fat-burning exercise to help you shred up, especially summer coming around the corner. Love this workout for that. Hey guys, I didn't know what to do to film for that outro, so I came inside. I'm going to film in here and just say thank you for watching. I hope you guys really like those five exercises. I use them all the time, so it's not like they're just beginner exercises. I do them all the time, and they help me get my abs. So I really hope I helped you guys out, especially with all this coronavirus stuff. It's a great at-home workout you can do. Peace. Hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys want more, let me know. I'll do them. So, yeah, bye.